keep rolling. Now it's Qualcomm Life. Good afternoon. I'm Don Jones from Qualcomm Life. Just in December, we launched three new uh, made three new announcements. One, we launched the Qualcomm Life Cloud platform to allow medical device manufacturers to put their data into the cloud and allow that data to be mixed between devices, meaning a healthcare provider or a consumer could collect data from multiple devices and have it presented into, into one format with the user interface. Um, we also launched the TuneNet Hub, which is here, which is a very simple plug-in-the-wall uh, device designed to have an experience for the consumer that's open the box and plug in the wall and then this immediately pairs that any other action required by the consumer to the various medical devices that are on the TuneNet cloud platform. So this is a very, very simple way of connecting medical devices to the cloud. It has many, many local area radios in it and it has a cellular radio for backhaul to the internet. So it's a very simple and inexpensive device. It's a class one medical device, an FDA listed device. And the cloud platform is also an FDA-listed class one device. So this is a very secure platform for the uh, medical device industry. Finally, we launched a $100 million uh, wireless health fund called the Qualcomm Life Fund. Uh, this is to make investments in the companies that are in the wireless health space. And today, this morning, some of you may have been at the uh, keynote where we announced the Qualcomm Tri-Quarter X Prize, a $10 million prize purse over the next 42 months for the company to develop, according to some very specific uh, requirements, the tricorder as it was experienced in uh, the Star Trek series. This is a use-it-yourself, self-diagnostic, personal <coughs> tool that would be used. Okay, uh, moving right along, how about uh, ruling that, Benji?